right, then you got to count over four heads. One, two, three. There's our winner. <laughs> Well, we got lots to do today. Uh -huh. Juana Bart showed up finally. Is he here? Yeah. Oh, I Gerald Beer, where Captain Super, Dan Horns here with one of his little friends, and you have lined up plenty of cartoons. They're on a projector ready, including a transformer. And we'll see the first one right after these messages. Okay. How do you do that? What the? going to be big, those big wheels, rah, 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 all that sort of stuff. Exactly what is the purpose of a mud bog? To get the cars dirty. See, that's why they call it a mud bog. There's a whole bunch of mud down there, and they get these cars with the big wheels, and they try to go through that mud. So the one that gets the farthest wins? Yeah, yeah. Uh, you try to get through it. Well, that's really something. Now, what's Ladmo going to be doing in a mud bog? I'm going to be emceeing it. And all the kids, kids under 12, will get in free. That's going to be something. I'll be giving away Ladmo bags. I'm going to have a lot of fun there. Here's the part you don't know. What's that? You're going to be sitting on the hood of one of those trucks when it goes into the mud. Ah. Oh, no. Hey, but I might drive one. Really? I might. <laughs> I might. Oh, <laughs> if they get one with floats on it so it doesn't go... Friday night, fairgrounds, bring good. your camera. Yes, yes. And kids get in free. I have live mode bags. I'm going to have lots of fun there. And those cars, boy, they're expensive. Photo Ooh. winners. Kids and their pets. Ah, uh, my favorite. I want these kids to come down and be on the show and get Ladmo bags full of goodies. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. We'll start here with Tyler and Brian Silverblatt watching TV with their dog. Oh, that good. Juan Solano and his kitty. <laughs> Here's little Casey Campbell getting a kiss from his doggie. Oh. Craig Freed, his dog. Looks like the dog's got sunglasses on, doesn't it? Yeah. Ryan and Carrie Johnson have an unusual pet. It's a guinea pig. Oh, looks, look at that. Looks like a cute fella to me. Uh-huh. And Amy Mata. And a picture of her and her. Is that a poodle? I think that's a poodle, isn't it? Looks like a sheep. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. We'll, we'll find out when she gets down. I want these kids to come down and get their Ladmo bags because they are photo winners, and we'll look forward to seeing your photo when you send it down. Where are you off to now? I'm off to see Gerald on the Gerald set. I'll see you in a little while, Walker. I'll be right back. Well, I guess it's time for Ladmo and Gerald. Jer, come here. Nice and cheery, don't you think? Yeah, yeah. Yours? Yes, certainly mine. One of, of mine. One, one. <laughs> hey, here's the question for today. Who's the most unusual person you ever met? Oh, that's easy. Ah. The most unusual person I've ever met mm -hmm. is you, Admo. Me? How come? You are the only person I know who has spent his entire life going around to shopping centers giving away bags. Oh, you're wearing lots of Admo. You're the only person I know that spent his whole life wearing a top hat, showing cartoons, and putting his name on things. Name on things? Well, like what? Oh, you name it. There's your waffles, T-shirts, toys, games, hamburgers, and those dreadful bags. The Lando bags. What are you going to grow up and lead a, lead a productive, meaningful life? Well, I don't know. But in the meantime, I'm sure having a lot of fun. Oh, hey. I give up. You see, that's what I'm talking about. Hey, Jerry, did you hear fun, about my fun, latest fun. project? I have a latest project. You're going to be fond of me for this one. What is your latest project? It's Ladmo's 11-foot poles for people who wouldn't touch people with 10-foot poles. That did it! <laughs> the Ladmo ah. 11-foot pole! <laughs> oh. There we are. We have winners, Wallboy. Well, I'd like to meet him. Okay, and what is your name? Amy. Welcome to the show, Amy. And now we're going to meet... Michael. And next to Michael is... Elliot. Hi, Elliot. And your name, sir, is... Chris. Oh, we have another row of winners way on top. Hi. Your name is... Scott. And... Debbie. Rudy. And there's Rudy. Okay. And they all have their Ladmo bags filled with lots and lots of good stuff in there. You all set for our next cartoon? Oh, wait a oh, minute. That's right. I got to go see Captain Super first, though, Wallboy. Before you go see him, I got to tell you something. What? 
Do you remember last Wednesday when Buona Bart was supposed to be on the show and he didn't show up? Yeah, yeah. Remember yeah. last Friday when he was supposed to be on the show and he didn't show up? Yeah, yeah. He yeah. finally showed up. He'd be on the show later today, and he better have a good excuse. He better have a good excuse. But right now, I'm going over on the hero set. To see Captain Super. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. See you later, gang. Well, gee, I guess it's time for Ladmo and Captain Super. Hi there, Arizona. And parts of California, New Mexico, too. It's me, Captain Super. I am a hero. See the hero flex. Flex, hero, flex. Color me red, white, and blue. Captain Super is good for America. And what's good for America is good for you. You know, I could go on and on like that. You know, Ladmo, it's important at all times that as you stand there listening to me offering these profundities to the audience, it's always good to remember that a hero must remain humble, even when he is hot stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about your message for today? Message? What message? Your message. You know, your agent called and said from now on, you would have an inspirational message for us every day. Well, as soon as he writes it, I'll read it. You mean that your messages are going to be written by someone else? Hey, well, let's face it. The reality is just my mere presence here should be enough of an inspiration to the youth of our community. But I'll tell you what. If it's such a big deal for you, Ladmo, I'll, uh, I'll see if I can't come up with something spontaneously. Uh, Ad lib off the top of my head. Well, Please. that's better. Ready? Yeah. Okay, here goes. Play on the goofy golf course of Captain Super's integrity and sink a hole-in-one on the back nine of life. Profound. I'll be back tomorrow with another dose of profound. <laughs> That'll give all you fellas time. Time? T time for what? Time to repaint this set red, white, and blue, that's what. Oh. After all, a hero of my stature needs the proper setting from which to perform, so... Why don't you hop to it, okay? A more patriotic decor will really fill the bill. Red That's it. Bye-bye. Okay. Bless you. Maybe with a roller. Oh, a roller? Yeah. Hey. In the Bear Essential News, uh -huh. the newspaper that goes into the classroom, yes. the latest issue of the Wallace and Lamo comic strip. Ah. What does it say, Lamo? It says... What? Oh, it's you again. Pet, 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 ruff, ruff, ruff. Go on, shoe. You've already had your supper. You know, you're not supposed to beg at the table. Whimper, whimp, snip, snip, snip. Oh, all right, have some more turkey, Marshal Good. Happy Thanksgiving. Yummy, yummy, yummy. yummy. Arf, arf, snip, and Marshal Good will be with us tomorrow on the show along with Captain Super and Gerald. Yes. Right now, let's check that bulletin board. First of all, we see the announcement. I think we talked about it a little bit oh, earlier. Oh, the mud bog. Yeah, Friday the... at the fairgrounds grandstand. This is going to be fun. I'll be there all evening. And then on Monday, and like every Monday, we're at the Peter Piper Pizzas. Whoop, whoop. That's where the birthday parties. You call Peter Piper Pizza for <laughs> reservations. You know, just in case you have a birthday coming up, you want to celebrate with Gerald Ladmo, you get a Ladmo bag. We have lots and lots of fun. All right. Uh, I don't know. What happened to him last Wednesday? What happened to him last Friday? But a, a no show two days in a row when he was scheduled. Buona Bart, that may be him now, finally. Check out. Oh, yeah. Hey, Wobbly, it's Buona Bart. Oh, we might as well let him in. Oh, you want to let him in? Oh, Buona Bart, come on in. Hey, we're just talking about you. I think where I'm have having you... a deja vu. I've been here before. It's yes, but, but where have you been last week? Remember, you're supposed to be here. Where have I been? Yeah, where have you been? I mean, we were worried about you. You were supposed to be on the show last week. You never showed up. Last week? Yeah, yeah, last week, remember? We had to schedule it. Oh, yes. Last week. Ah. Now I remember. Sure. You see, Ladmo, I was on safari just outside of Avondale. I was bitten by a rare strain of mosquito that causes temporary amnesia. What? Amnesia? Yes. That means you forget things. Everything. Yeah. Where you are, who you are, who are you? I'm Ladmo. Oh, Ladmo, 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 remember? The one with the top hat. Forgive me, I forgive me. I, I'm still suffering some side effects. So anyway, I was out there wandering around for, oh, nearly a week. Well, well didn't you get hungry? No. 
I forgot to get hungry. <laughs> That's amazing. Not nearly as amazing as the discovery I made while I was out there. You did? I've discovered why people live in Avondale. Why? Well, you see, they were all bitten by the same mosquito that bit me, and they think they're living in Ahwatukee. Oh, that's incredible! What's incredible? Never mind, never mind, never mind. Oh, right. uh, it's good to have you back. Well, it's good to be back, I think. I, I think... <laughs> We have a lad will present Super Friends winner, and your name is? Tasha. Tasha Scott? Okay, and Tasha wins all these prizes. Prizes from Toys by Roy, Milton Bradley Games, Hobby from Val's Hobby Hanger, the giant Tootsie Roll filled with Tootsie Rolls. <laughs> and then it can be a cup of bank, see that? And what else? Oh, Charmkins and Lando Bag, Cookies from Cookies from Home, Charles Chips, all that good stuff. And all this is yours, Tasha. And once again, thank you for entering the contest. Now, all this is yours, but will you excuse me? I gotta go see what Wallboy's up to, okay? I'll help you with that in just a second. In a little while, we'll be going back over to the studio audience to find another lucky seat winner. Exactly what did you put in the Lama bag? I'm gonna tell you, Wallboy. We have chips, potato chips from Clover Club, a Peter Pan personal pan pizza from the Pizza Hut. Whoppers, that chocolate covered malt, and mmm, a uh, free Lanmo slider from the Lanmo drive in, and ooh, sunflower seeds, animal crackers, or cookies from the Bisco Coca Cola Quaker Granola Bar. We have a butternut candy bar from Hollywood Brand. Patty cake, Hootin Toots, Hootin Toots, that's cream filled, ooh, Slurpees from 7 Eleven, and from Bevel up in Payson, we have lollipops. Ooh, these are all different kinds of flavors, grapes and all that. Ooh, from Toys by Roy, we got those stickers, too. And newspaper, Bear Ascension Lou. All right. Huh? Sounds good to me, Lado. Okay. It's time now for Dan Horn and Orson. I'm okay, ready. Okay, here we go. Hey, Orson. Orson, I want to ask you something. Yeah, you know, what is it? Well, Orson, what do you do to make your life interesting? Well... I'm glad you asked that. Yeah. Yeah, I like to go to nightclubs and heckle the Canadians. <laughs> hey, that's not very nice. I know, but it's fun. <laughs> it ruins their timing and they get all mad. <laughs> well, uh, what do they do after you do that? Well, they try to put me in the place. Ah, uh, with a verbal retort? No, with a strong bouncer. <laughs> Next thing I know, I'm lying out in the gutter somewhere. Oh, Orson, you should be careful. I mean, you could get hurt. Yeah, so what? It makes my life interesting. Mickey Rooney and Judy Garland made a lot of movies together, but this one was their very best. Babes on Broadway, and it's our family theater movie this Sunday at 12 noon. We gotta find a couple more winners. Okay, well, what? Who was sitting in this chair here? Huh? <laughs> Oh, my God. I thought her? we lost somebody. There she comes. Hello. We're glad you're back. Oh. All right. Ladno. Yes, Ladno bag winner first. All the way to the top row. The top row. To your right. Four heads over. One, two, three. Why, that's you right here. What's your name? Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. Okay, now I'm looking for a Charmkins winner.